Hi, we just left Casablanca and rode a train to Marrakesh, Morocco. We are a young traveling family and I'm Marida, he's Dre, and our little girl, Mombi. During the ride, we met a guy who arranged for us to be picked up at the train station and to experience a lovely tour outside of Marrakesh. One of the best tours we've had so far. Hi. We're starting our day, but we're starting our day in a rush because we were supposed to meet up with this man. He was supposed to be here at 10, but he never said anything. So we just assumed maybe he's not going to come. Don't, don't assume that way because... He's here and we rushing, but thank God we know how to rush pretty fast. But we're about to go get a tour of the city. Or maybe a little bit outside as well. So I just wanted to say hi. Good morning. And let's go. Let's go see something. I didn't want to leave you guys out in the panic of rushing this morning. Yeah. So. <laughs> right? Yes. I should have got my butt up earlier because I was up earlier, but I was still tired because I went to bed extremely late. And yeah, so now we left rushing trying to get out the door. Summertime, you can't tell. Look, clay and hay. hay and hay. Uh -huh. Wow. Up the steps we go. Nice. Let's go and see this beautiful view, guys. Two big cities, Marrakesh or Casablanca. Some of them moved to Israel. Some moved to, some other ones moved to America or to Europe. They are everywhere. But they are, they stay always Moroccan. They come time, time to time to, to smell the original. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know, they keep them. Mm -hmm. Some of them they take them out in the morning. Got you. And they come back in the afternoon because Got they you. cannot save all of them. Got you. They need a lot of food. Got so, you. so they spend the whole day outside. And but Got some you. they keep them here. Got you. Uh, Cow, cow and donkeys and some other meal are outside. Here, let me, can I get in there and yeah. take a better look at those guys? <laughs> it brings, it makes me smell of. Brings you back home, huh? It brings me back to yes, being in Kenya yes, again. Yes, yes. So this is the, they still the wind there, the wind there, this. And even the Tajin, come to see the Tajin. Look at this. Oh, yes. Oh. It takes time. It takes time. But it's very delicious. Yes. I know so. Oh, I they, cannot tell you how, how tasty. They use all them beautiful herbs. Yes. That's why. Yes. The, all the vegetables mm -hmm. comes from the valley. Organic. Everything's tasty. It's really tasty. It's beautiful. So yes. Beautiful. So beautiful. Yeah. It smells good. Yes. <laughs> So this is part of the kitchen. <laughs> Come to see here. Then we are going to show you something special. Very special. Smell, still smell. Uh-oh, be careful. It's the wind. Uh, look. Towers. This is a mask. Okay, the mask over there. Every tribe has his own mask, really? private, wow. because the tribe it's below to one family, so they have their own mask. Mm. Mask and sometimes Quranic school, where the ch children study the Quran and the Islam, mm. and the grandfather is the teacher. Mm. So oh. every 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 tribe has private mask okay? for family. For example, this tribe they cannot go there. Right there, yeah. you have it. You can now can you what is this? That looks like a heater to me. It looks like what they used to cook, right? Oh, no. 
Yeah, no, they put fire here. Yes, mm -hmm. they put That's fire. why I said what I said. Oh, so it's a beer? I'm thinking no. it could probably help keep it warm, maybe. The building warm? No. No? no? It's not for cooking. Not for cooking. Water. No. no? Heat, they will heat the water. Heat the water. Ah, yes. mm -hmm. No, yeah. but not exactly. This is not the right answer. Mm. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm. huh. But you're very close. You're close. Mm. Is it? I was going to say to store something. No. No? Oh, no, I see water there. Open and see. A greenhouse? Is no, it, no, it's not a greenhouse. Because it's I see green. the. Oh, yes, we're so good. I see the chimney here. Like, like they come up from the fire. Like this is where they put the water. Mm hmm. You give up? Mm. Okay, I give up. I don't know. I see cups up there. Oh, this cup? Yeah, there's cups. Wait, do they bathe in there? They do? Ah. Uh, they? They, you got me beat. I'm curious. Can I see the little light at the top too? You got me beat. When did you move here? Oh, I was young. Yo. I was five or six years old. Did you remember some things in Kenya? I don't think, I, I'm sure they have some things like this back in Kenya. I'm, I'm not sure, but I, that's why I'm asking you. I was very little. I was did, you little. Ne did you never come back? No, I did, you but did? I didn't see this. Or maybe so, I didn't pay attention. This is hammam. Mm. Mm -hmm. You that? know what means hammam? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. The Turkish bath, where we wash. Mm. That's what I said, a bath. Oh, hey, yeah. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so got it. I yeah. seen I seen the cups and yeah. the yeah, well, yes, yes. and the and the yeah. stool to sit on. Let, let, let me explain oh. to you. It's not shower. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Yes. Yes. Hammam. We call it in Arabic hammam. Mm. So mm. the hammam normally in our culture mm -hmm. we do it once a week. Okay. Mm. So in the big cities there is public hammam for everybody. Mm. Mm -hmm in the tribe because it's private mm -hmm. so they have their own hammam got you oh. they do it also so what they do they put the fire okay mm -hmm. water inside they close the door for 50 or one hour then and it steams it exactly there. steams and it's getting higher like i mean hot mm. like 50 or 60 degrees mm -hmm. then we go in mm -hmm. we stay like just relaxing like 20 minutes or 25 mm -hmm. minutes the hose of the skin is good for the health, and the dirt, and the dirt scars starts getting easy. Mm. Then we ask for brother or sisters. If the sisters, of course, mm -hmm. sisters come, scrub the back. Mm. Okay, mm -hmm. and after soap and the soap and shampoo and they wow. So that it takes it takes at least one hour. In one the hour. Cities, it's public, it's big, yeah. it's huge. Yeah. But this one is private. Yeah. So this one they use it just in summer. And they have another one inside. They use it for winter. Because in winter it's cold here. Yeah. It's snowy and windy and they cannot take a risk from fifty or sixty degrees to one or two or five minus zero. Mm -hmm. So they use the one inside. Uh -huh. So if you think about it, it's almost like a sauna. Mm -hmm. but yeah. they, they, yeah. No risk to get cold. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay? Mm -hmm. Yalla. Yalla, that's Waha, nice. Waha. Let's go. Let's Waha. go. That's good. Waha. Good one. Attention for the human. So you're, not, I, you're yeah. not drinking with this? I'm Ramadan. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you're sure right. I'm like, where's his tea? I forgot, dude. Those are, they're fasting. It's Ramadan time. Um, for Ramadan, you can at least have water. I'm trying his tea. Nothing. It smells, no water. It smells Nothing. very good, guys. Oh. That's it. Good. Tea is very good. Yes. Is, is there good. any sugar? Do they put sugar, sugar in it? Or no? Sugar. They do. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I see I've been missing out. Like, mm -hmm. I said I've been missing out lately because when I go to the coffee shops to yes. the caps, I normally just get a you know a regular coffee. I see everybody drinking these, but asking you said what they are drinking. I should have. I should have. But I just normally just get the coffee, you know. But I've been missing out this whole time.
national drink. It's uh, mm -hmm. popular yeah. everywhere you go. They mm -hmm. offer you. Beer. So, all right, guys, we made it to the place where they make the rugs at. And from what our tour guide was telling us is that these rugs here um, are handmade, unlike in the city where everything is imported from China. You can just imagine how long it takes for these people to um, to make one of these. I'm sure gonna ask, because they're huge. Look how huge they are, guys. That's well, that's kind of when you say you say this one. I like this one, but you need more bigger. I give you from this lady, not the other lady. Mm. So they always put their names on Maria. Maria, mm. Maria, Maria, come to see the nice view here. They are with this door. Okay, this is the tribe. The what? Oh, yeah. Uh, we the same with them. This is tribe, this is tribe, this is tribe, this is tribe. Each tribe, you have the name, each tribe, you have the design. Oh, different designs. Different design. Tribe. This tribe, you don't make a good design from another tribe. Ah, I didn't even realize the red right here. Yeah. It's come from the uh, Atlas High. Oh, from the Atlas Mountain? Mountain? Yeah, yeah. Ah. Oh, more rugs down there. Maybe they wash those. And that's why they're out here. I don't know. Look at all these rugs. Yeah. 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 All these rugs. And the sixth tribe from Taznat. Okay. Again, as you see, they are like dates. Mm -hmm. Right, we, we like that. Look at the nut. Mm -hmm. This is the nut. Look okay, at that one. Roasted, unroasted. Unroasted, exactly. Uh, the woman, she starts rolling it, rolling it, rolling it. You press the almond inside to get that paste. Exactly. That one is that The other one. one, the other one. Yes. So it's clear like that. You mm, see? Yeah. All those cotton coming out after pressing. Now we apply black silk to remove its skin to get a soft skin, like a baby. Here we prepare our Berber Nutella. It's without chocolate. It's oh. with almond. You can taste if you want. I can. We crush it here, the almond, with the argan oil, mm -hmm. if you want, to get that cream up. Then mm. we sweeten it with the pure, pure honey from argan flour. Oh. Yeah. Our small burger breakfast, even if it's too late. Oh. <laughs> we have four edible products. Firstly, that one, it's argan oil, and the other one, it's rich with vitamin E, omega 3, it's good for diabetic people and cholesterol. This is the chocolate one, right? Yes, without chocolate. Oh, but <laughs> without, without chocolate. It's so healthy and yeah. energetic. Yes, babe, you want to try? Oh, that's good. <laughs> Yeah, she'll try. What is her name? Mommy. Mommy. Mm-hmm. How old is she? One. One year. Time. <laughs> no? Try the honey. For you? Can I just eat the whole thing? Yeah, just... all of it. It's not very hard. It's so good. It's a big bite. <laughs> For you! <laughs> For the queen! <laughs> Okay, our thoughts so far of the tour, we're still in the middle of it. Um, I feel like looking 
the experience of the argan oil was actually really really phenomenal it here really was. i think it was way worth it because you could actually see the action and really explain the so we really think this one yes. was really really worth at it at least compared to the other one we've seen in casablanca yeah so yeah the one in marrakesh that we, that we see today was very like well, how would you describe it i mean i feel like it's just like that something was actually more hands-on with us here and let us sample things and sample. try things and stuff yeah because right. we already seen one up over there yeah, and now we've seen true. another yeah. one in totally different ways yeah i feel it's it's, it's an experience because you still explain to us but i feel like this if you're gonna do it original come where you actually get to sample and try yeah. that's what we think was you'll really enjoy that from it then i feel like going to the village I think that was really an experience that was pretty cool and and actually it being explained to like each village is for one family and the, the extension of the family that's how they build other houses and that's how you end up being a big village it has a mosque and that's the same place where they teach the kids like very informational and you get to see it and everything don't feel any bad even giving money to the lady because they let you inside their home yes, exactly. so that one I feel like was completely worth it I mean, you see the carpets, you don't have to pay for it. We didn't want to because we were going to put the carpet. Yeah. But, um, so you could just go see I mean, it. They have off. other things in there too besides the carpet. They do have like some silver uh, nick things you can buy and everything like that. But we just, you know. It, but it's beautiful though. Yes, and at least to know that it's the villages, different villages making that carpet. So you know you're supporting that family from that village. But it's pretty much what you want. Don't feel pressured to buy something. It's on you if you want to. We felt we wanted to give and buy something at certain places that we wanted to. Exactly. So you do what you want to and don't feel pressured. But all in all, we're enjoying this tour. It's really cold over here. Well, really windy. And oh, and the whole reason uh, with the Ramadan time. Yeah, some places are not open because of Ramadan, but of course they are servicing when tourists come through. But we eventually need to find some tea because we have not eaten all day. <laughs> but on to the tour. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 